I want to talk to you about the power of a story, more specifically the power of your story. Did you know that the Bible says in Psalm 139 that all the days ordained for you are written in a book? Meaning there is a story that God wants to tell and he's telling that story through your life. I'm reminded of how Jesus was a great storyteller when he would stand in front of the people and he would say, the kingdom of heaven is like. Think of him saying, imagine a world like this. It was like he would reach out and he would grab the heart of his listeners and he would pull them through Narnia's door and bring them into another world that they had never experienced. So what's my point in this? My point is, is when we begin to tell stories and we let our life be the story of Christ, it begins to present spiritual possibilities for people that is outside of what they're experiencing in the natural. That's what Jesus was doing. Is he was presenting heavenly possibilities. He was stirring up the imagination. That's the power of your story. It stirs up the imagination of people around you. It gives them the possibilities uh, that they probably haven't even begun to think about. You are shifting just information into a reality. See, Jesus was doing more than just giving them information. Then he would give a demonstration and he would say, let me show you the reality of this kingdom I just told you about. A lot of us have heard amazing things about God. A lot of people around you have heard about his miracles. A lot of people have heard about the ways of God. But it's your stories that bring that information into reality for them. So I want to encourage you to realize and recognize the power of your story. That your story will stir up the imagination of the people around you. And your story will present their possibilities in Christ. So be bold about your story. The Bible says that we overcome by the blood of the lamb and the word of our testimony. That word testimony means I'm sharing about my story with Christ. I'm sharing, sharing about my story with God. It's a testimony. I'm sharing my experience, whatever it is. And, and it means to do it again. In the Greek, testimony means a do-over. It means I want God to keep doing these things. So when you are sharing your story, you're throwing out into the air the possibilities and people are grabbing a hold of them and saying, I want that for my life. It motivates people. It inspires people and, and activates the Holy Spirit in their life to do it again. This is the power of a story. More specifically, it's the power of your story. So talk it up. Share your story. And remember, enforcing purpose, it starts with you.